There are two main reasons in my mind why University of Maryland is one of the best places, if not the best place, to undergo care for mitral valve disease and other valvular disease. One is that we are able to offer robotic cardiac surgery as one of our platforms for approaching valvular disease. Uh, we are able to perform a myriad of surgeries with the robot and, uh, and offer these approaches in a less invasive fashion than the traditional sternotomy that you might otherwise receive. Secondly, we are able to do this in a very unique heart team approach at the University of Maryland, where we work together with interventional cardiologists and review all of your information very carefully and clearly, so that at the end of the day, you are being considered by multiple people and, and you are going to receive the best option for you. When I'm talking to patients and offering the robotic approach, ultimately, uh, what, how I explain this to patients is that there is uh, there's multiple ways to handle the problem of whether they need their mitral valve replaced or repaired, or if they need another valve intervention, a tricuspid valve or an atrial fibrillation procedure or what have you. And the way that I explain this is that for years and years and years, we've been doing traditional sternotomy open approach surgery where we go through the center of the chest and we're able to do any sort of mitral valve intervention that way. And that way works, it's tried and true but we've essentially perfected the techniques that need to be done to repair or replace mitral valves and tricuspid valves. Those techniques have been mastered over a number of years. Offering this surgery with the robot is a way to do the exact same surgery with less invasiveness. So we are able to, we're doing the exact same surgery in that we're approaching the valve and so we're stopping the heart, opening the heart, and repairing the valve, replacing the valve, and doing everything we need to do to the valve to fix it. But we are doing it in a different approach, and that's the only thing that really changes, where we come from the side of the chest between the ribs without doing any rib spreading or rib breaking or anything, and we don't have to go through the center of the chest or break the bone or go through the middle of the sternum or saw the chest in half. We don't have to do any of those things. We're able to just go from the side, go between what you have, and repair re repair the mitral valve, replace the mitral valve, and do anything else we need to do with the robot that way. And so it's, the, it's a different way of doing the same surgery that you ultimately need.